Designed for individuals with limb differences, assistive touch is controlled through gestures, like clenching and pinching. For example, to stop a timer, double clench to activate assistive touch. Pinch your index finger and thumb to move focus to the stop button, then clench to confirm. In some applications, you can also use these gestures to perform quick actions. For example, to answer a call, you can double clench to immediately pick up. There are also additional controls for more complex navigation, like ending a workout, double clench to bring up the action menu, pinch to move focus to the motion pointer, and clench to confirm. Now you can move your arm to hover the pointer over the edge to scroll the page. Then hover over the end button to stop the workout. The motion pointer can also be activated by simply shaking your hand. So that's assistive touch. With this new feature, we're able to open the doors to Apple Watch for even more people in a way that hasn't been possible before.